Yo, Koso, welcome, willkommen, bienvenue, hola to every participant. Let's begin. Really? I shouldn't be moved by the number of YouTube followers, but I'm happy that there are now 101 people on the whole planet who like to follow along. That's nice. Everyone came on his or her own way to this Zen Qigong. So thank you for following and performing alone, really. Every one of you is special. Slide shaking. And the, the main, main topic is health and uh, getting calmer kindness, mindfulness and peace towards meditation, uh, sitting meditation, of course. And everything which is involved in the whole package, you know, not just the ordinary Qigong, it's, it's Taoist, it's yoga way, it's Buddhist way. I'm a lay Buddhist, you know, but when you are reading all the books and so forth, the Sutta Pitaka is open in very many languages, so you can read it and learn it for yourself. And then you might notice that all the spiritual paths, all the spiritual paths are all talking about the same. It's something called enlightenment, but ah, it's not so easy to understand. It's normally, it's really nothing so special, you know? But the way is very hard to find sometimes. You need to sit around, you know. Know thyself, at the ancient philosophers of Greek, we are talking about. So I'm not calling this Tai Chi or Qigong meditation. It's a very good preparation, of course, because you are learning about your body in the first place, very, very subtle, and it's endless, and it's good. And there is also something called walking meditation. And that's what I'm talking about now. I don't, I don't call it meditation, but it's a preparation for monks and so forth. So when they are too busy with their mind, you know, they are coming to this walking meditation and also to loosen up their limbs. So it's a little bit like a very, very reduced form of yoga or a moving Qigong or something like this. But the awareness, of course, is much, much mm, deeper, not higher, deeper. So you are not talking with yourself, of course, but it's the best way to describe, you know. I am aware that I'm standing in my right leg, evenly distributed soles of my feet, of my foot, my standing leg's foot. I'm aware that my left leg, leg's heel is up, a little weight in the front balls and uh, tiny balls of my toes. 
I'm aware that I'm lifting my right foot. I'm aware that I'm putting, uh, moving my right foot to my left and so forth. It's endless. It's talking, talking, talking. But uh, your inner chatter isn't that much, you know, but it's really, really slow and you are extremely aware of every split second. So, uh, so you are moving very slow. And the other topic is you are uh, searching for one point and another point in a straight line. So I'm just moving from one point to another without thinking about it. So you are never coming to a destination or something. It's really, um, some are walk walking in a circle. So that you are really keeping your mind and body together. That's the aim of it. And that's the aim from, for Qigong and Yoga and even Tai Chi. Because uh, some, is some I know this form already, you know, up to the next. And this moment, when you think you, you know it already, is the first, the, the very fresh first time you are beginning with this Qigong and Tai Chi, you know? Because you are not so tied up in thinking how to do something and so forth. You are... That's the first step to get deeper with your awareness within yourself. Enough talking. Enough talking. Get an awareness back to the bottle breath. Back to the question, am I calm with myself, with everybody, everything around me? Am I kind with myself and everything and everybody around me? And am I aware of what is happening within me? and around me. You see, it's also, it's a good exercise. You are learning how to breathe fully, which is bringing you more oxygen, which is good for your health and for your mental abilities. <laughs> And it's also relaxing. So you got plenty, plenty of benefits. And the inner smile is coming by itself as a very good reward. And this is all without any force. You know, it's the total opposite of everything everybody has told you so far. Huh? That's really an easy way of living because there are even scientific evidence that the flow state is really productive, you know, even in, in our society, but we don't like it. I don't know why. And your question without answer, because the answer is your feeling, how do I feel now? for performing with me along in the sunshine but as you know I'm comfortable with every weather you know, with every inner and outer weather 